What is up, guys? It is John on the Game Master Guys here. What's up? It's me, XNAB11. Hey, guys, I'm Sparkster28. And welcome back to another exciting episode of Pokemon Gold, Silver, and Crystal. So, in the last part, we battled through Price and we got the badge. I forgot the name. The Glacier Badge. The Glacier Badge. Yeah. We're a lot, we're a lot more dramatic if I knew the badge name, but I have a memory of a goldfish. Or a magic card, I should say. Because goldfish didn't exist and any of this kind of animal stuff didn't doesn't exist in Pokemon. Actually it's So happens. yeah. Oh well, I don't know but well in the anime they show fish. Like legit fish. Yeah. Like and, Well anyway, so we're, let's head to Golden Rod City. So here in this part, we'll be battling nothing but grunts. So at the meantime we're gonna have some nice discussions or whatever. Nice <laughs> cup of smoothie. Or cup of smoothie. Knows. A cup of tea, a cup of coffee, a bottle of water. I enjoy, just relax. I enjoy the parts of nothing but grunts here. Yeah, Anyways. it's really the same Pokemon. Raticates, Raditas, coughing, Murkrow, the average Ekans are Arbok. Anyway, so expect us to beat up every single grunt, because there's a lot of grunts you gotta take care of. Like a lot, I mean a lot, trust me. The reason for it is because this is the last Team Rocket push that you'll see for a pretty long while in the Let's Play. Well, anyways, uh, in Heart Gold, Soul, Silver, if you go to Golden Rod City, I believe, I don't think they'll let you in first, or I think, and I think you kind of... You have disguise. You have to be disguised as a Team Rocket member, which was actually pretty cool, honestly. It was, yeah. And I was wondering if we get to go to different cities too, or at least just as a Team Rocket and see what the NPCs would react, but unfortunately you couldn't. So, yeah. It was a pretty nice thing to do. I was, un I was unexpected too, that was like a nice change that they added. To this day, Hard Gold and Soul Silver is still, is still one of the best remakes I've ever played. In Same honor. here. Yeah, I agree. I enjoyed going revisiting the Kanto region, I enjoyed listening to the Kanto remixes in 4th gen. And fourth gen music ish, yeah. The sad thing for me was I never got to really trade with anyone at the time. I mean, so I, if I wanted a golem, it was kind of limited. I did have one, but you know, I mean, is that one average golem I had? <laughs> Let's see. It's like. Let's see. So, let's see, I'm going to try and battle every single one of them, but not every single one of them. So, I believe that after. Eventually, you have to go to the underground, I believe, not just on the radio tower. Yeah. Yes. Because I know that, because, uh, actually, we never even been to the underground. I, but, well, we have. Never mind, we actually have. You had to get the, um, did you guys get the coin case? Yeah, we all did. Yeah. yeah. To, haircut, to gamble. All that stuff. Oh, yeah. Fun fact about gambling, actually. I heard that in, uh, let's see. Well, I think in the first few generations, many, well, I don't even know, honestly. I, I forgot how to how I forgot how this uh, censored version, well, censored plane, but I guess parents. I don't know, honestly. I kind of forgot, but I know they got rid of gambling after third generation, I believe. Like get like like my slot machine gambling and all that nonsense, because you know they, they anything was like because you know kids because you know kids gamble in Pokemon, and you gotta be like at least an adult to gamble nowadays. And oh my God, why is it okay? Good. And I know, and, okay, so, okay, well, what's my point is that in, in, in Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire, they got rid of gambling, they got rid of the casino, because I know in that game, or well, well, in Ruby Sapphire, they actually had a, uh, a casino there in, uh, what was it, Mauville Town? Yeah. And then, and then the remake, I know that, and it's no longer there anymore, I think, and it, I know they mentioned something like, uh, oh, we're, we're now closed now, we're just, like, out of business, or something, going out of business or whatever and then, yeah I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure they did that just because that uh, because of uh, like censoring nonsense because you know like so you burn it for kids out of gym <laughs> I don't think it has nothing to do with four kids at all <laughs> I, I mean, well, I, four I, kids did like most it's like four Pokemon episodes they like took off the air I really wish I could have seen them though the one with Jinx, Porygon and Dragon Dratini well, Porygon was banned everywhere, except Japan, but you only get to see it once, and then they took it down. Well, actually, you can still watch it on the internet. You just have to watch, you know, the Japanese version with subtitles. Yeah. 
Well, I seen glimpses of it. It was a really weird episode. I actually watched two. Well, not all the whole thing because I wasn't really. It wasn't that much of interest. It wasn't that interesting. But I did see. But I did see the parts where it gave many people seizures, and I was fine. I didn't. I didn't feel any like affection or anything. Same here. Yeah, yeah, but you know, people are different, so it, it, it affected other people, but it didn't affect us. I don't know who thought that was a great idea, honestly. Just like doing, just like giving them like flashing colors and all that nonsense. That's just weird. Are you guys speeding up through the admins and executive? Oh crap! I forgot to do that. How many times? I think I was. I did, but I got so distracted. I already no, no. everyone in the tower. Okay, so I, I'm gonna speed up too. I didn't know I was, if you guys were gonna speed up the admins or executives. Yeah, I did. I forgot. I, 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 while I was talking, I forgot to speed up. <laughs> Oopsie. Oh well. See, look, look how, look how, uh, I'm sorry, but I just, look how strong Pikachu is now, like, compared to Pikachu, like, it's actually more, oh, hi, Porygon. <laughs> it's funny, we talked about, I was saying there as soon as I can. We talked about the Porygon, and, yeah, we kind of didn't go Porygon. Not wild, but, hey, some scientists had one. Hey, bro, and I don't have one. Just walk out of here with my head going down. Oh, you, you, you can't rescue me? Is that what you're expecting? Oh, wrong. I'm an imposter. I pretend to be the real thing, but prepare for your takeover. Do you want to know where we hid the real director? Sure, I'll tell you, but only if you can beat me. Alright. So oh, I'm beat him already. I'm about to go to the um, underground. Alright, so let's take care of this. By surfing. The underground, no Super Mario. <laughs> Plays the underground theme. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Okay, that's enough right. Jeremy's beats. Let's go back to Pokemon now. I received the basement key. Hooray. So remember, so you remember that underground that you battled a bunch of weird people under there? And, uh, the nerds and maniacs. Yep. Yeah. Uh. And, and I know you can talk to the... Um, oh, you can get haircuts there too. And the coin case. Yeah, and the coin case too. Yeah, well, you, let's go back there again, because there was like this one hallway that you couldn't go there before, but now you can. So Guys, make sure you have your Pokemon healed, because there are grunts and our rival is down here. Alright, so let's get down here. Just letting you know that. I'm not going to battle him until you guys are there, unless Chris already touched him. <laughs> yep, he did. No, I didn't. I'm joking. Apartment door? Oh, whoops, I took the... I got so confused. I got so confused with the under the actual underground was because I went to the magnet train by accident. <laughs> Oopsie. Had a little blonde moment there. Baseball. Shut up, Jeremy. Your, your moments were a lot dumber. Oh, there's my rival. Hi. Hold it. I saw you there, so I tailed you. I don't need your underfoot while I take care of Team Rocket. Wait a second. You beat you beat him before I you okay. That's a fluck. Well, he already pays doubts. Or dubs. Okay, so... Okay, so we're not speeding up our arrival here, because our arrival's more important than the grunts. Okay, okay. I oh, guess. Yeah. I did. <laughs> really, Chris? Wow. <laughs> wait, 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 what did you say? Chris speed up to the rival. <laughs> I don't... That's... Oh, that's messed up there. Yeah, well, too bad. Too, too bad. I, I, Renegade for life. You know what? I'm not gonna. Be, I'm, I'm actually gonna take my time through the to the rival battle because it's really important. Renegade, JK Low. You're a All renegade. Right. <laughs> Alrighty. My Ekin almost on. Fire blast. Okay. Because I use fire blast on a Magnemite. Oh, okay. Yeah, because weak to fire, you know, steel is weak to fire. I know the type difference is I'm more of a master than you are. Ha! <laughs> Bullshit. <laughs> now, anyways, let's switch out to Sunny. Since it's a sunny day, like I said, no storms yet, unfortunately. Because it's nice to see the rain, because we rarely get rain here in Texas. Texas is all dry. Hey, look, Chris. I'm Texas. Okay. 
Basically, Hunter just killed himself by using Curse. Okay, then. That's kind of... Okay, he just... Hunter just committed suicide. That's kind of dark there. Alright, so let's send out Sneasel. Alright, so let's use Fire Blast on that Seasonal. That hurt my ears now. By using Screech. Fire Blast! Ah. Alright, I'm gonna almost take down a Sneasel. Alright, so he has the last Pokemon, which is his starter, Meganium. You know what? I'm gonna send out my starter, too. I know that it's weak to grass, but I got Ice Punch. You sure you'll be or okay? It, or an Ice type move. Pretty sure I would. Yep, I have Ice Punch. Alright. Bah. Hey, it's frozen! I'm so lucky! <laughs> Woohoo! I made a Meganium froze! Take that, Chris. It froze your Pokemon. Only you know it's not really yours, but. Yeah, you jackass. <laughs> so you have a Meganium. That means you're going against me then! So you, so you took out my Frolligator. Or if, or if you had a Frolic. Wait, does he even have a Frolligator? No, he had Quilava. Oh, no, never mind, huh? Let me ask. Jer I should be asking Jimmy. Wait, what did you say? Does, di okay. Did your, did your rival had a, uh, a Frolligator? Yes. Okay, so you got the stars. Alright. He still, he still thinks that training your Pokemon is from love and care is not the thing, though, since all he cares about strong Pokemon or whatever that he... He's, he's... You're not even the best trainer. Go away, you loser. Just some trainers never learn. Just some trainers never learn. We never get we never get rivals like this ever again. Well, I know blue. Well, I know blue is a lot nicer than the rival in this game. Cause I, cause I think blue also cared about his Pokemon too. Yeah. Blue cared, but he was still a jerk to the um actual trainer that you play as. Yeah, but here all he just wants a strong Pokemon. He doesn't care about your. He doesn't care about love or anything. He's like using them as he uses them as tools of war. Cause you know everyone like what everyone says. Pokemon are not. Are not well, I use Shadow Ball every time. Anyways. Pokemon are not, are not tools for war, they're friends. True. I always remember them. Even though we seem like we're using them for, for battling and friends. What can, he, what can he do with... Well, besides Pokemon and me, I don't know what else he can do with that computer Pokemon and friends. Now, back in person, all you could do was battle. Remember that game, Pokey Ranch? <laughs> on WiiWare? Uh, what? You're talking about my Pokemon Ranch. Yeah, that. That's a game? Yeah, it's a game. Oh. I didn't even know that was a game. It's on a farm, and then you have Pokemon in your range. It's pretty much another Pokemon storage system, kind of like, you know, Pokemon Bank. I never Dude, understood like, the game. Like, I always said I wanted to get it, but I didn't understand it. I, I, I had it for a while. Apparently, it's a burg I just, I just, I'm battling a burglar right now. Right, I'm going back to the Pokemon Center, because I need it! Alright, so... No one's in here. Okay, so there's nothing here. Okay, right, let's, let's, let's hit the switch right here. Okay, we'll switch to. So yeah, just like a little puzzle here. Yeah. Huh. In the basement. No, not here. That burglar sunglasses looks nice. Which one? Turn. Oh yeah, I actually got my clock fixed, by the way. Oh, yeah, thanks to yours, Julie. I'm just playing. No, like, I haven't sent in the video yet. I got my clock fixed. Oh yeah, yeah, I don't think so. Oh yeah, so between the parts, I said that I said it was morning in my area, but I fixed it. It was a pretty difficult process. I was trying to get the code because apparently trying to change your clock in this game is like rocket science. Like, uh, if you got pretty, I don't know if you guys know about this, but uh, uh, just in case you guys don't know, I'll explain it anyway. So if you want to change your clock, you have to do like a certain button combination, just like how you normally delete your delete your whole entire data in in, no, in Pokemon games or the DS or whatever. I know you I know you have to like do some random button processing or whatever. But here in this game, it's still there. But thing is, you can also reset your clock too by doing that. But but it's not as easy as you think. By doing that, you have to set a password in. And I don't know how the math works honestly. I just use a calculator. 
and from from like a Pokemon website or whatever to to fix that issue or whatever. Like, like it just depends on on the on your on your trainer name, uh, your trainer ID, and how much money you have. I don't know all that kind of nonsense. But it's real yeah. easier if you take like if you put all your money and give it to your mom. I was gonna tell you that, but I was away. Like, if you give your money to your mom, it's less math that you have to do on the money part of it. God, I hate these doors. <laughs> Any, hold on. Okay, so I know it has, okay, I know it's I know it's Switch 3. I know it's that. Yes, I'm out. Okay, don't worry about it. I'm out. God, oh. I never want to go through that garbage again. Okay, I was going to do some backtracking. But anyways, so after we took care of all that, let's go inside this door. All right, all the doors are on now. I never want to do that again, ever. Let's not do Heart, Gold, and Soul Silver. Never. We never going to do it in the first place. Oh, How fun. Good, good. I don't want to do those doors ever again. Yeah, and you know, well, actually, I, I, I won't say anything. You're not going to get any farther. I don't show any... Okay. So let's take care of this grunt here. Childhood's existence when they played this game. Th those doors. I, I, I thought that was Whitney. <laughs> For most people, they say Whitney. So, okay, so let's take care of the... Oh my god, I'm confused. No. Yeah, I'll put more dying. Okay, so let's get this thing real quick. Time max ether. Alright, so it's important because Monkey can't unavoidable Monkey. Okay, so let's see strength. That experience here is really helpful. I can tell you that, like, right now. Oh, I haven't, oh, I haven't even put it on. I gave it to my Pokemon yet. I gave it to my Steelix. He's, like, at the highest level on my team right now. Oh, I think I found the director. I did right, too. You know, strength in it. Okay, one of the Pokemon just kill themselves. Oh, never mind. They both. Okay, so coughing just self destructed. Okay. Okay, so we got the TM35. And let's see what he has to say. What is TM35 anyway? Who? What? You came to rescue me? Thank you. The radio tower. What's happening there? Take out my Team Rocket? Here, take this card key. And I got the card key. Now, uh, anyways, this is a shut, shut doors. Okay. Okay, so to go back to the radio tower again and use the card key on that one area that you couldn't get through, that was kind of gated. Yep. So yeah. All right. So let's get out of here. Let's get out of this mess. Oh, found an amulet coin. That's a pretty useful item there if you want to get more money. Just get out to your Pokemon, and they'll get extra money. See? We were in the department store, like in the underground. Yeah, but not the underground underground. It's all 50% right. Now that I'm thinking about it, can we just went there instead? No. For, to avoid... Oh. The door wasn't open. You may have been 50% right, but you're 100% gay! <laughs> You know, I said it was a sunny day earlier. I see cl now clouds. Now clouds are blocking the sun. Oh really? Yep. All right, so get out of here. Now Pokemon are all healed. Now let's get back to the radio tower. Now we're inside. All right. All right. More evil music playing. So let's go all the way back upstairs and let's avoid these pointless grunts. At least try to. Well, I already battled. Nope, never mind. I take that back. I haven't battled every single one of them yet. All right, took care of that. Yeah, I'm speeding up through these guys. I don't care if they're admin or not. Yeah, I, I already beat everyone. All right, so the car key, and I have to battle him now. So let's do this. Next to Pikachu is gonna take out the whole entire thing. Now, let me switch teams at least, because Pikachu is poison. So, let's set out my Gatorade actually. I'll make you that my experience shirt to my Pokemon after this. Yeah. Alright. Oh, this, oh, this, oh, these Team Rocket members do not want me to beat them at all. Does not want to be defeated. Alright. Just go up here. 
I think I have to even go through the Pokemon Center for my way here. I already did. This is my Pokemon already poisoned. Oh crap. Yeah, I'm, I'm even gonna speed up to the last guy. I don't care. Fire Blast, awesome. They're all, all pocket right. people. Yep. Let's get that one item trap there. If I can get to there, this. Uh... Oh, you managed to get this far. You must be quite a trainer. We tend to take this over the radio station and announce our comeback. That should bring our boss Giovanni back to his solo training. We are going to regain our former glory. I won't allow you to interface with our plans. So now we have the non-epic battle of history here. It's just another you know, extension that looks the same as the like any other one. Not being racist, but ah. they look the same. To tell you the truth, well, some of them. I saw someone who was just like him earlier. I just killed my friend. All right, so let's. Are you telling me you're speeding up? I am. Great. How could this be? Our dreams have come to naught. I wasn't up to this task after all. Like Giovanni did before me, I will disband Team Rocket here today. Farewell. So we defeated Team Rocket for good now. Yep. John, thank you. John, Jeremy, Chris, thank you. Your courageous actions have saved Pokemon nationwide. I know it's not much, but please take this. So receive the clear bell. I got the silver wing. I got the rainbow wing. Yeah, we received different items. There used to be a tower right there in Goldenrod City, but it was old and creaky, so we replaced it with our radio tower. We dug up that well during, during construction. I heard that all, po all sorts of Pokemon lived in Goldenrod in the past. Perhaps that bell has some connection to the Tin Tower in Ecritique City. Ah, that reminds me. I've heard a Team Rocket whispering. Apparently, something is going on in the Tin Tower. I have no idea what's happening. But you might have to look into it. Okay, I better go to my office. So, all three of us got different items. And I found an Ultra Ball there. So, these three different items are pretty unique. And, and, they could be used for something really special. Basically, in certain different versions of the game, for gold, you can get it. With that thing, you can get like different Pokemon with that, with that item that, that the director just gave you. So it can come to pretty good hands. So yeah guys, thanks for watching. Feel free to leave a comment, like, and subscribe for more gold, silver, and crystal content. I went to the wrong way. Whoops. So the next part, we'll head our routes and seek new ways. Well, and continuing well, our journey. We're going to be heading to Blackthorn City now. Yep. And get our last final gem badge to become... The Pokemon Master and get to the Pokemon League. Something so Ash yeah, never does. <laughs> so yeah, thanks for watching guys. Bye. Bye everyone.